My name is Irene Londrick. I'm from Austin, Texas, and this is my quilt, Mr. Bojangles Dance. First of all, I want to say how honored I am to be included in this show. A lot of these artists have been my heroes for years. And then imagine my delight after that at being awarded the Emerging Artist Award at the age of 69. So that means I have a lot of work ahead of me. I don't start my quilts with any kind of agenda or story. I work entirely improvisational and intuitively and fluidly. And um, I start my piece with a single piece of fabric that I put on my design wall. And I call my process dancing with the wall because it's basically a dance. So I start with the piece on the wall. I step back about eight feet. I study it. I decide what I'm gonna do next to respond to it. I go to the cutting table, go to the sewing machine, go to the ironing board, and I go back to the design wall. I step back and I respond to those two pieces together. And so all my quilts start at the, bin, at the center and then just grow outward. Um, it's very rare that after I have responded to anything that I go back and change things, but sometimes I do, but I don't sew it together until the design is on the board. And um, after that, then I start what I call engineering the piece, uh, which is a challenge usually and piecing it. Um, what this does, the whole process enables me to be, to get out of my own way and to be creative and to let things just emerge and to see what happens. And that's the excitement for me. And I find the, the entire process keeps me engaged from the minute I start with that one piece on the wall until the quilt is finished. And it's always a surprise what it turns out to be. And um, I just find the entire process extremely delicious. So Mr. Bojangles here is part of a series I'm pretty much finished with at this point, which I improv, but my technical challenge at the beginning was to try to create movement and gestures and colors um, to kind of mimic dances and different dances. And so I would just kind of start, not with what the dance was gonna be, but just start and go, okay, this one, I'm gonna do this kind of movement. I'm gonna do jerky movements. I'm gonna make it, you know, a waltz and I'm just gonna do fluid. And then when I get to the end, I look at it and go, okay, what is that dance? And in this case, Mr. Bojangles just kind of jumped at me. You know, he's just kind of a jazzy kind of fellow. He may be a little down on his luck. And um, he's, um, he's a little steampunk. And um, so my first date with my husband back in 1970, we went to see Jerry Jeff Walker in Austin. And the first song he sang was Mr. Bojangles. And then it kind of became our song for a long time. So the minute this guy was finished and on the wall, I looked at him and I went, hey, hi, Mr. Bojangles, start dancing. So that's pretty much my story and um, thank you. <laughs>